Hey guys and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a wig review on the Outre Valentina. This is a lace front wig and I just think that it is the cutest style. Um, I will be doing a must have wig fall series brought to you by Divas Tress. So this wig and the other three were sent to me by Diva Tress and I'll be doing a review on all of them. So four wigs, four weeks, all that can be worn in the fall so you don't want to miss it. Go ahead and subscribe and stay tuned for my next three videos. All right, let's get into this. All right, so this is the packaging. As you can see, um, I'm just going to take my scissors and snip off the, uh-oh, just gonna snip that off. So this is what it looks like. This is the color. Isn't it just lovely? Like what the heck? I love it already. Um, so this is basically what it looks like straight out the packet. It looks pretty good to me. I don't see like any tangles. I don't see um, it looking like horrible quality. I see that it is a very nice wig. All thoughts are my own, so these are real reviews and I will let you guys know if there's anything that I see on the wig that just is not working. But anyways, so far so good, so let's keep going. All right, so I'm just gonna take this off, kinda see what this is, okay, fancy, fancy, okay. All right, so here's our tag. I'm gonna go ahead and snip this off too because I do not want people looking at me kinda crazy. All right, so now we just have this. Let's just take this off real quick. So now we have our wig. And as you can see, the wig has clips on the inside of it, which is very, very convenient for um, clipping it to your scalp and then one back clip, which is very convenient for clipping it to the back and making sure that it's secured on your scalp. So of course we do have this um, front lace wig, which is good. I do enjoy front lace wigs as well, but I'm gonna go ahead and start cutting it off right now. So personally for me, I won't be sewing it down. If you've kept up with my channel, you'll know that I recently cut my hair so my sides are a bit buzzed down. The back is a bit buzzed down. I got a tapered cut. Um, if you haven't watched the video, check it out. I will leave the link in our description bar below. I'm gonna get to cutting this wig and show you guys exactly what I'll be doing. So I'm going to take my scissors and I'm just going to carefully cut. And there you have it. So fun fact, I used to actually think that cutting the lace off of a wig was like the hardest thing to do. I don't know why, but I was just like, what if I ruin it? What if I mess it up? Like, what do I do? Um, but honestly, just do it slowly, do it safely, take your time. If you wanna cut precisely, don't rush while cutting. Just do it slowly and let's just hope it turns out right, right? All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and try this baby on. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so already I'm kind of seeing that I'm going to need to plug. If you guys can see that, but there is like no place to place for a middle part. Like, that's just not cute to me. So we're gonna go ahead and quickly just pluck that, okay? We're just gonna pull up the other way because this is not gonna work out. Be careful not to pluck through your closure. Cause that's a real thing guys, and it does happen. Okay, so this is kind of what we're working with. I do love the volume of this hair because I love big hair, so it's kind of like me already. Um, what I do love about this hairstyle is that it's very versatile. It has many parts. This part can be moved to different parts. So I'm gonna do that, do that in a second once I put some foundation on my middle part. So I'm gonna be using the color Fawn and LA Girl Pro Conceal. Um, I'm just going to take a little bit um, of concealer 
and I'm going to just dab it on there. That, which looks a lot more natural. All right, so I'm gonna keep playing out around with my hair. As you can see, this is what it looks like in the middle. I really like it. It's a really like, just do you, be you um, type of curl pattern. And like I said, it is a versatile wig, so you can turn it to the side if you want to. If you fill yourself with a side part, that works too. Um, I think I'm going to probably maybe stick with this middle part. I'm not really sure yet, but um, I just love how I love how full the wig is, and I love how it's not like huge, but it's not like, you know. Um, so I really like that about the wig. I love that um, it comes in this color. This is the DR30, and I love that it came in this color because um, it's so fallish, and it's so me right now, honestly. Um, I love it. <laughs> um, yeah, so I think the only thing that I would say that um, kind of concerned me with the wig was the middle part and the plucking. Um, it did come pre-plucked, but um, company pre-plucked isn't the same as human pre-plucked or what we would consider pre-plucked. I feel like the more I wear it, the more I'll get more versatile with it. And yeah, so um, all, my, all the information will be in my description bar below. Make sure you check out the wig. There will be coupons in my description bar, so make sure you read that. Make sure you read that and subscribe guys. I'll be reviewing four different wigs for must have fall wigs in this color. So if you've been obsessed with this color like me, literally I've been like obsessed with this color all fall, um, you're gonna wanna get these or get the wigs that I am reviewing for the next few weeks. So yeah, stay tuned. Let me know what you guys think about this wig. I really like it. Um, I really do. Like I think I just, I don't know, I just, I just feel like it's so me. Like, wow, like, goodness gracious. My goodness, this is just fantastic. It's great. All right, guys, um, this is the end of my video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe, hit that button, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this review. Um, I'll see you guys next time on my next must-have fall video. Bye.